they're thinking out of the box, or rather, out of the bonnet. This Israeli company reinvented the 150-year-old internal combustion engine and now wants to use it to provide power to remote locations around the world. We achieved an engine which requires far less parts, it weighs less, it's more efficient, it emi its emission level is lower, and uh, with that we hope to, you know, to send it all across the, the globe. It's a feat of engineering whiz and imagination. In a normal engine, the pistons move up and down to rotate wheels. In Aquarius engines, a single piston moves side to side, creating combustion on both ends. It converts natural gas into mechanical energy, which makes electricity to power an electric motor. So how much does this beauty weigh? Uh, this one is 15 kilograms. And how much would an equivalent engine weigh in a normal car? Over 100 kilograms. So, this is light enough that I can do my weights with it, and the full-size thing in a car would weigh more than I do. And it's been shrunk from a 20-plus kilo prototype to a new model weighing only 10 kilos. It's effectively a miniature power generator, and Aquarius spies an opportunity to sell it to developing countries that need more power to meet rising demand. We're working right now with two very large uh, multinational companies that are interested to provide electricity to over 750 million people in the world that don't have access to good power generation. And because it's so small, it can be transported to remote places in African and Asian countries that don't have the infrastructure to move such massive generators. If you look at today's power generators, they look like a very large refrigerator. So you need a truck, you need a crane, you need good roads. I think of many places in the world who don't have that infrastructure. If the full solution is going to be like a large luggage versus two refrigerators. So it will be easier to transport it. The inventors were met with skepticism, and not just because they were reinventing a design that's basically remained the same for a century and a half. In one of our meetings, someone said, but you know, Jews and engines are not really, uh, you know, it's not synonymous. Aquarius plans to pilot its engines in North America and Asia in 2019, and from there, it's full steam ahead. Elon Levy, I-24 News.